thousands of pupils in the West having to stay off school, contact tracing is being used to reduce the number missing classes. In secondary schools, year bubbles can be over 200 children, so that means everyone's staying at home, even if one child tests positive. But Fiona Lambden has been to a school, Hannam Woods, which has brought that number right down. The impact of COVID continues to touch everyone in education. A week ago, the virus arrived at this school in South Gloucestershire after a pupil in year nine tested positive. Initially, all 155 students were sent home to isolate. But with track and trace, staff were able to study seating plans and CCTV and work out exactly who had been in contact with who. Like a military operation almost, um, kind of identifying seating plans, going to the classroom, measuring two metres from the child's chair, uh, identifying those students, uh, identifying members of staff that maybe had contact with them. And as a result, 121 students were back in class at the start of this week. So how are Gandhi and Martin Luther King similar? Is it A or is it B? A, they both believe change could be made through pair. Philosophy, religion and ethics is being taught in this class. These six are the lucky ones. You can just get everything done here and then go home and relax. And everyone wouldn't have to be... It'd be easier, the teachers would be... It'd be easier to teach us. But there should be 31 students in class today. The others are still learning just at home. This is the dining room now doubling up as Fiona's temporary classroom. It's weird that I've, I've kind of gotten used to it because obviously we've been in lockdown for so long. I'm used to sitting on the table and doing my work and just getting on with it. Um, but it was nice to see my friends for a couple of weeks. It's also causing problems for Fiona's dad and his work. It's, it's difficult. Um, I'm self-employed. Um, working in the fitness industry and then it's just kind of this state of flux that you can't get your teeth into anything that you you want to be doing um, because you never know what's going to be happening next week fiona's allowed back to school next tuesday but the school fully expects there'll be many more cases before this pandemic is over fiona lambden bbc points west south gloucestershire